In this video, I'll show you why I believe any passenger, car, truck, van, etc. can be converted into a sleeping space where anyone can get a good night's sleep. It's very simple. It's a matter of just creating more space inside the vehicle. Feel free to skip ahead if you want to see the red light nighttime quiet voice tour of the inside of my cabin. The first step is to remove some seats because the seats are not always necessary. And once you remove seats, it's easier to create a level surface inside of the vehicle. As you can see from these two different seats here, one with the bottom removed, one with it still intact. I didn't technically need to remove my front seat, but I decided to do it anyways because then it made space for an entire suitcase to fit underneath where the board would play. Choosing lumber for building a bed in a car. This is what I'm choosing. I just need two boards to go the width of the passenger seat, essentially, and bridge the gap from the back to the front. I used the camera measuring app on my phone to estimate that the width of my passenger seat was 24 inches wide, so I got two 12-inch boards. I had to put them in at an angle still for it to work just because of some, uh, the inside of the car is not square. If you get a power station too, then you can really live off grid and not have to use your car for energy also. Let's go down with the tour. quite beautifully, you see. You just open the rear passenger door, open your sleeping bag, and then you just sit down and you're in bed. Just like if you were in bed anywhere else. And there's some water, some some chocolate shake, protein drink, an axe maybe. You know, everything you would normally have by your butt. I kind of stopped counting the days because this was just working for me. And it's been 11 days I've been not living but sleeping in my car. If you're a subscriber or you noticed my video yesterday, you may not have noticed that there's no passenger seat. Maybe you should have. Maybe you should pay more attention to detail. That's it. For now, I'll try and put links to some products in the description. Um, any questions, let me know. I'll probably make more videos about this in the future. This is just a quick introduction to help anyone else who's struggling to have a place to sleep that doesn't come with a lot of financial stress. That's what I needed, that's what I've got, and I love it.